Hi friends, in this video, I will not make the typical Photoshop tutorial, but I want to create not one, but two images without making any shot or any editing. The first one will be little more art and the second one will be way more realistic. See that intro and let's start creating. We are in Photoshop and I will use the new generative view feature. And let's start with the first image, a little more art. Let's select the wall image, click Generative Fill button and let's describe what we want. Let's say um, Magical Landscape. Let's see. Okay, not bad. This is also good. I want to pick the perfect one, that's why I'll click the generate button again for three more options. This is good. This is also good. And I like this one. Okay, let's start with this one. And I want to add some trees maybe on the left of the image. Let's select this part, click Generative View, and simply Trees. Let's see. Okay, a single one. Let's see this one and this one. Let's take another try. Click Generate again. Hmm. I'm not sure. Maybe this one. Okay, let's add some water, maybe a river. Somewhere here. Let's see. Simply river. Hmm. Okay, let's see the second one and the third one. Let's see another three options. Click generate again. Let's see. Hmm. I think this one is good. I like the reflection. The reflection is very close to the sky and the clouds it's very good okay let's add some magical animal maybe somewhere here click generative view and type magic animal let's see <laughs> okay let's see the second one and the third one Let's see three more options. I'm not sure. Oh, okay. This is good. I like this one, but I'm not sure which one is the best. Okay. The first one. Now, what we can do with the sky? Maybe, what if you add a moon? Let's try. I'll select this part and click Generative View. Moon. Let's see. Oh, okay. It's good. This one also is very good. For now, the first one is the best, but let's click Generate for three more options. No. This is also very good. It's not exactly the moon, but it's very fantasy. Okay, let's pick the last one. Let's add some more trees here. Trees. Yeah, 
Not bad. Maybe this one are good. And I think this is perfect. Maybe one more magical animal here. Animal. Okay. Let's see. Maybe this one. Okay. And I think it's perfect. Let's see the steps one by one. First, magical landscape. Then add this tree. A river. The first magical animal. The moon. Then little more trees, but I'll say grass. And the second animal, magical animal. And I think it's perfect. It's very art. We have anything before and after, okay? <laughs> before and after, without any shot or any editing. Okay, now let's try something a little more realistic. Let's create a new file. Again, I'll start with select the whole image, click generative fill, and now maybe beach sunset. Let's see. Mm, no, this is not bad. Okay. I think this is a good one, but let's click generate again for three more options. This is also good. No. Okay, let's start with this one. I want to add some palm tree on the image. Maybe somewhere here. Click generative view and let's say big palm tree. Let's see. Okay, let's see the second one and the third one. I like the second one, but let's try another generate to be sure. Let's see. Okay, I will use this one. I like it. Now let's add a boat, maybe somewhere here. Simply boat. Mm, no. I think it's too small. Let's delete the layer and select a little more bigger. Maybe something like this. And try again with boat. Okay, let's see the second one and the third one. No. Generate again. I like this one. Yeah, it's good. And depends on the size of the boat. I wanna add a girl. And when I see the size, maybe the girl has to be something like this. Click generative view and let's type a lonely girl. Let's see. We have two girls. Let's see this one and this one. This one is a little girl, but what? It's good. I like it. Let's click generate again to be sure. No, no. Okay, I'll pick this little girl. And what? If, if we add more clouds, let's try maybe something like this and type clouds. Mm, 
Yeah, it's more impressive. I like these quads. And let's add uh, some ship, maybe somewhere here. Type ship. Mm, no. No, I don't. I don't like it. I'll delete that. Okay, it's not bad. It's not bad. Maybe if we add uh, some rock here, let's see. Rock. Okay. I'll stay this one and I'll try again with the ship, but we'll select a less area, maybe something like this. Let's see. Okay, now it's good. Maybe this one. If we decrease the opacity a little bit. Perfect. Okay. I think we're ready. Let's see the steps one by one. From empty image. First, beach sun sunset. Then the palm tree. After that, the boat. The lonely girl. More clouds. The rock. And the ship i think it's perfect and guys as we see the new generative field tool it's amazing you can create a wall image without taking any shot i hope you like it subscribe with the bell for more videos and see you soon